next contest is set for one fall with a 10 minute time limit introducing in the corner to my right from Auckland, New Zealand weighing in at 240 pounds it is Tony Scalia and in the corner to my left from New York City weighing 239 pounds it is the unpredictable Johnny Ross. Should be an outstanding matchup as well. Tony Gurria and Johnny Ross, they've met many times in the past. Always a good match. Here we go. Pausing for this commercial break. On Wednesday night, August 11th, the cool ocean breezes definitely will be in force in Atlantic City, New Jersey, and that means professional wrestling will be once again taking place at the convention hall. Time to appear for the likes of the Italian sensation, Salvatore Bolomo, dynamic Pedro Morales, the Intercontinental Champion, huge Black Jack Mulligan, and no doubt the great Ivan Putski will be looking forward to his return bout on Wednesday, August 11th at convention hall on the boardwalk, Atlantic City, New Jersey. On Tony Gurria. I tell you, Vince, I'm sure you've saw Johnny Rogers many times as I saw him in action. He's a very tough competitor, well experienced. Especially when he gets mad, he gets going. Chops it a throw to Gurria down to the canvas. Johnny Ross moves very well. He looks good. To the rope, trying to set him up. Chop the miss. Korea, flying body press. No, no. Tony could not hook the leg of Rods, and therefore Rods able to push out of that. Definitely. I think if he would have hooked the leg, as you said. Oh, man. look at that. Rods attacking Tony Korea as he was distracted unintentionally by the referee. Rods trying to set Korea up. Back, no. Sunset flip. That's him down. Two. Still can't get him. Rods with a right hand lunging and connecting. He is quick, Vince. You don't turn your head to, to Johnny Rods. He's going to be on top of you instantly. Korea reversing it, and Rods caught in the rope down to the top keeper's table. Swinging back in the favor of Tony Gurria as Rods limp against the rope. Gurria sending him to the far side. Uh-oh. Telegraphing that maneuver. Rods anticipating the attempted back body drop. Across the shoulder. Rods using the ropes again. Elbow across the top of the head. Rods going up there again. Rod, drop kick by Gurria, back out, back body drop, Gurria covering Rods, he gets one, two, and that's all. Rods is a tough competitor. Huh. Gurria snapping the leg. Well, if you're as quick as good Johnny Rods is, if he has a bad leg, he won't be as quick. Tony continues to work on the leg. By the way, we've been given notice that next week on Championship Wrestling, scheduled to join us will be the Polish power, Ivan Klutsky. Tony Gurria and Rod pretty much dip in touch here. A seesaw battle is now Johnny Roth takes over on Tony Gurria. To the rope, shoulder block by Rods. 
Trying for it again. Korea going down. Rod. Oh, did you see that? He gets it. Quick maneuver. Johnny Rods actually hurt himself. He was ripped to the rope and caught his Adam's apple on the top rope. Came back and Tony Gurria was there for the cover. An opportunist, Tony Gurria. He is a great wrestler. Here is a time, four minutes and 12 seconds, and the winner, Tony Gurria. Tony Gurria getting a well-deserved uh, applause from the fans and scheduled next ladies and gentlemen over most of these stations take a look at salvatore Belobo, who's made a lot a lot of fans here since coming over from italy and as we outlined earlier next week on championship wrestling the super pole ivan putski will join us and also pedro morales we'll be back with more action in a moment <laughs>